Hey guys, it's me Flipped with a, another Pharaoh's Quest review. I got the set today at the Cincinnati Lego store because I'm visiting here for Thanksgiving vacation. And I also got two large pick bricks um, and they're ready to go home. I got some like 2x4s in this one, then a lot of detail bricks in this. Like, if you see those red tiles, those will be used in my upcoming um, mock or diorama, which I'll be entering into Lego Boys contest on Flickr. It's a Flickr only contest. But this set is the Pharaoh's Quest set, set number 7306, Golden Staff Guardians. It has seven pieces and is recommended 6 to 14 of age. is. It comes with three minifigures. And what I've noticed is that all the sets come with three minifigures, except the small one and except the pyramid, the big one. But yeah, so I'll start with the minifigures. First of all, we have Jack Reens again in a different version. Um, he has a overall kind of thing and a muscle shirt, and you can see his abs in it. And then he has some, I don't know if they're blood stains or oil stains, but right where those dots are. He has um, a new face. It has like um, a tic-tac-toe guy there. And then a smirk, and then some sideburns. I don't actually know if he's Jake Green's, but I'm not sure. Because this is, I'm pretty sure he's not, because this is the Jake Green's from the other set. That's its face. So I'm pretty sure he's not Jake Green's, but I'm just going to call him that because I don't know his name. But yeah. And he has um back torso. And then he has the helmet and goggles, just like the one from the Flying One set. And this is my second Pharaoh's Quest set. And it's uh, you get a really good deal out of it for 10 bucks. And so that's with him. That's done with him. And then you get two of these, so I'm only going to review one. But also, before I review this guy, um, I said in my last review, when I was reviewing the plane, the Flying Mummy attack, that I said... um. Toys R Us only sells these. Not they don't. Like I thought they didn't, but I went to the Lego store and I found out that they didn't because I saw these, so I picked it up. But these guys are probably like the best figures in the set. Really nice. They got um, gunmetal kopeshes. The blade is kind of bendy. You, you can bend it. Strong plastic handle. Well, not really, kind of, but. Like, if you wanted to get a brick for Jordan Kopesh, if you got this, it would just, like, it works the same, so I would just recommend it. It's really nice. And really good Kopesh. And then, he has a black mummy headdress. And he has a little tail thing. It's basically the, it's exactly the same as the one from that, um, Series 2 minifigure, the Pharaoh. Except black, completely black. And compared to the other one, it has a little dot right there. Then it has the two-sided face, the one-eye face, and then the mouth face. And then it's got the um, same body as the other ones, same legs, and same back printing. Then it has a really nice beetle shield kind of thing. Here's the handle, and then here's the actual, it's like a, it's really nicely detailed beetle shield. And this, this one's the same thing, just the face is turned around. So that's it with the minifigures. And now onto the motorcycle. This is, the motorcycle is actually, I really like it because I don't have one. And it has some new pieces on it, like the body and stuff. The body, as I've seen of it, is a new piece. This is two pieces, the red and black piece. You stick them on. And then you add it on this light thing. And it drives really nice. Got some lights up there. Plant for a gun and dynamite. And you can, if you put it perfectly straight, it just stands up like that. And then this is where the rider goes, and I'll put him in there real quick. Pretty, really nice playability. And then there you go. Whoa. And then there's that. And he just can drive around. Room, I guess. And then this is the golden staff place. The staff is really nice. It has the same, like, coil things as like the series two minifigure like I said with those guys but then he has a curved thing up here and there's a little hole Lego put in here so you can put stuff and like maybe you could 
put a crystal there. I don't know, but yeah, you actually can. Like, you can put something like a crystal in between it. So it's like, boo hoo ha ha, fear my cr crystal of power, right? Zap! Or something like that. And then you could just put it back. The crystal doesn't come with the set, though. I just got it from a different set. So I'll just leave it how it is. But you put this here. And then the play, like the play model for this is if you see, like, the back of this, you push that and then it comes off. So if you go to the back of this, there's this little thingy. And you just push it. And this falls out. But this does too. That's the only bad thing about it. But then here it is blank you get the new piece the new piece and then there's some grass and it has some pretty good parts do it the um sets like i said before 10 bucks and i would highly recommend it it's really nice really good detail and stuff and it's a really good like um addition to bricks and other stuff like this staff but now um i'll show you the construction manual and then i'll show you the box so here's the construction manual, it's really small, and then in the back we have the other set, it's in the hieroglyphics, and then here's the small set, one minifigure, the Golden Staff Guardians 3, the Attack of the Weather Sphinx 3, and then the Attack of the Cobra Thing 3, and then um, the Flying Mummy Attack. I have the Flying Mummy Attack and the Golden Staff Guardians, and the next one I get is either going to be the like ho these are the next ones I want the pyramid or the um, probably yeah the, like the cobra attack and those are the next ones like I want to get and then it says win on the back for some reason well to, like the one Lego sets I guess and then there's the staff and the back just shows the guy like holding up the kopesh with the staff and then that yeah so really good set. Get your money worth. Get your money's worth out of it. I think, personally. So this has been another Ferris Quest review by the Flipped, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. And bye.